Backup devices. In this example, we are using a Petzl ASAP lock. To open the device, we pull down and out on the two small handles. Place the rope in the device with the arrow pointing up and closing the yellow handles. Notice we have the device attached to our sternal harness point. This device is designed to automatically grab the rope when exceeding 2 meters per second. To test this function, we can hold the device high above our head and quickly slide it down to engage the lock. You can see that the ASAP has locked and won't move down any further. If there was enough force applied during a fall, the ASAP Zorba access would potentially deploy to reduce the forces applied to our body. To unlock the device, slide up the rope a small way and the ASAP is now free to move again. In the situation where you want to ensure the ASAP remains in its position, we can manually apply the lock function to engage the rope with this small yellow button. The device is now locked. To unlock the device from this position, move the button back up. The device is now free to move again. To take the device off the rope, pull the yellow handles down and out, take the rope out, close the yellow handles and store on your harness.